Hello, my name is Stuart Herbert and I'm recording a series of videos showing how I use Sublime Text 2 for doing PHP development. And in this video I'm going to show you a very simple plugin that I'm sure you'll end up using many times every day called Go to Documentation. And if we go to the website for community packages for Sublime Text 2, and type Go to Doc in here you'll see there's one plugin called Go to Documentation, which is well worth installing. Now, unlike some of the plugins I've shown you already, this plugin requires some configuration after installation. So you would install it using package control as normal, and then what you need to do is you need to create your own key binding for it. Preferences, key bindings, user. Now what I've done is I've bound it to the F1 key, a hangover from my days with the Borland C++ IDE back in the early 90s. Um, you can bind it to anything else you want. I, do, I think the author recommends Control Shift H if memory serves, but it's important that you've got to do this step. You've got to add the key binding yourself before you can use it. But once you've once you've put the key binding in place, it's simplicity itself to use. All you need to do is select a built-in PHP method or function. And in this case I've picked the venerable isn't and then I press my chosen key setup which in this case is F1 and what it does is it pulls in your web browser takes you to the PHP manual using the PHP manuals fantastic built-in search. Very simple, very effective something I'm sure you'll find yourself using a lot. A plugin I highly recommend. And I hope you found this short video helpful.